What's up YouTube, Assassin here, coming to you with a review of my new laptop. It is a HP Omen 17 3 inch laptop. So far, my thoughts of it are nothing but good reviews. It has this nice carbon fiber rubberized kind of feel. There's not a lot of flex into the screen. So like you open it up here, you can open it with one hand. The screen doesn't really like bend at all. The actual hinges for the screen are really, really sturdy. I've had some laptops that have the actual hinges that move the screen up and down have cracked or broken. So first of all, let's take a look at the laptop. Sorry, I'm struggling here. I'm using a GoPro. This is really hard to do. So first we'll go to the back and then we'll cover all the ports and stuff. So here on the back, we got a nice HP, we got a nice Omen logo, just like there on the front. And then, so we have two ports for the fans, one here, one here, and then another one over here on the side. And then on this side, we have a, another fan, heat sink let out or whatever you want to call it, something to lock the laptop in. Another, we have a USB 3.1 port here, a headphone jack, microphone jack. All the ports on this side. Holy crap, this thing is heavy. <laughs> That's the only downside I've noticed about the laptop is it's since it's so big, it's heavy. We got an SD card reader here. Something for that looks like that looks like the Mac Thunderbolt port. Two more USBs. It also could be a Display Port. I'm not sure. Uh, it kind of looks like a Thunderbolt port, but I'm not sure what it is. Two more super speed, um, what's it called, USBs. A HDMI, here's for your internet, an internet plug-in, and then the power brick, which I have down here on the floor because I haven't needed to charge it because the battery life is amazing on this thing. Let's power it up and show you guys all the extra nice features. It has a really nice sound bar that I like. This, it sounds amazing. Of course, I can't really play anything for you guys to show you what it sounds like. It has a nice touch pad. It's got LED backlighting on the keyboard. So that I will turn that off real quick. Um, what button is this again? Uh, da, 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 da. Well, it's probably not gonna respond because it's in startup. Uh, it's loading up, I think. Not sure. Looks like it's loading up. Could not be, I'm not sure. Let's give it a quick restart here. I think I had some updates that are being a little messy. Sorry about that. So it should start up just fine right now. And it looks like, yep, there we go. So it just had a little glitch there, that's okay. Cause I also think I already got a virus on it, but that's not a surprise when you're me and you download a fudge ton of stuff. Um, so as it's starting up here, we'll talk a little bit more about the features. I think it's just an all around really nice laptop. Super easy to use, Windows 10. Super, super, super speedy when it um, when you don't mess it up <laughs> like I do. Um, here we go, we're already into the operating system, boom. So this is a Core, let me open the specs page because I don't know all the specs off the top of my head. Uh, whoops. So it has two hard drives in it. It has a 120 gig SSD and then a two terabyte extra drive. So it is a Core i7 6700HQ CPU at 2.6 gigahertz, which is plenty fast because there's multiple threads and that's a quad core processor. 64 bit operating system, 16 gigs RAM. It is a, in, sorry I burped, NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1080 TI or whatever it's called, 1080M something, uh, eight gig video card dedicated chip. So it's not just, it's not like it pulls eight gigs from the actual RAM in the computer. It's its own chip with its own dedicated memory, which is amazing for gaming when you actually decide to game on this machine, which you'd be stupid not to, because this is a 4K, this is a 4K display. It's also, the extra nice part about it is with that video card this game this laptop will easily run any game in 4k because it's an 8 gig video card you can get it in two options you can get the 1070 edition or the 1080 edition 
And I figured, why get a 4 gig video card when you can get an 8 gig video card? I just figured it was a much better choice to last for the longest amount of time it could. Um, I think I've covered everything about the laptop itself. Not too sure though. But I will bring you guys back with another video at some point about this laptop with an update and how I feel about it later on. I've only had this laptop for a day now, so I've had it. This is my like 24 hours thoughts about 24 hour thought mark. Well, I, I don't know what you want to call it. So 24 hour late, 24 hours later, these are my thoughts about this laptop. You got another HP Omen logo there, and then Bang Olsen, I think is the sound, the speakers in it, I'm not sure. I haven't done very much research on it, but so far I really like it. The one downside is it's heavy, the power brick is massive and a pain in the ass to lug around. But other than that, the performance of this laptop is unrivaled. I really like it. It's an amazing machine. And I think that's all I have to say about it. And YouTube, this has been Assassin, and peace out. Bye.